Hey, hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome, welcome, welcome to this special event for this week. Well, for the month, for the year, for Sunday. <laughs> and that is going to be two hours around Le Mans here on GT Sports. So if you guys don't know, we're going to be doing a live stream for charity for the children, boys and girls. Uh, we're going to be participating in... Um, in donations well not donation but for charity for uh saint jude's children's hospital a uh, research hospital uh if you guys would like to donate to the cause uh, i'm gonna donate after the stream uh fifty dollars uh just go through right there i don't know if you guys could see it if, i don't know if it's on my end but uh you guys should be able to see it on the chat it's all right on the top if you guys want to click on that link it leads you guys to a link and then yeah our goal today is just going to be for a hundred dollars if we can pass that goal then that'll be awesome you guys will be absolutely amazing um, so yeah, uh, but as you guys probably can see right here, it is a little bit different the way that everything is sorted out now. I decided to uh, make a little bit of upgrades to the stream. I wanted to make the presentation a little bit better and what better way to do it than on this special, special event. So if you guys saw the intro was a lot different, the animations between the scenes are going to be a lot different. And now right here, you can hear some music in the background, so it's not just so dead you know there's actually like some some live you know some 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 pizzazz to it but anyways let's see who's in here right now mr assassin hello ray what's going on phil i saw you in the chat hello goaded as well and they call me jay he says let's go definitely let's go let's go let's go good luck yeah definitely we're gonna need luck here for daily uh for room a so the way that the, the the race is gonna be done is there are two rooms so we got room a and room b um there's a couple of people streaming room b i'm not sure who's streaming room a i just know it's gonna be me uh and i, I don't know who else is gonna be here streaming it but we'll check right now uh, when we get into it but yeah it's gonna be split into two rooms it's gonna be group one and group three cars and i decided to elect to pick the group one cars i just felt a lot more comfortable using the porsche um and around this track and also i just wanted to overtake people you know i didn't want to be the car person in, in uh group three so we'll see how we do here for this race hope you guys are ready for this one and like i said cross my fingers again it is a charity event but we are going for a win here boys and girls so uh, let's see what's in here as well hurdle turtle he says good luck in room a thank you so much hurdle turtle sir max turbo my boy hello what's going on ryan fisher what is up what's up my dude christian vines is streaming as well christian there you go christian vines is streaming as well so uh he is a uk guy um streaming as well so if you guys want to go check him out as well but let me just show you guys around real fast so uh again we have the new transitions um so i'm going to transition to the gameplay so here we go um look at that boom, boom. there we go there's the gameplay right there uh the pedals are a little bit off but here we go so we can show the pedals right there uh we have basically me back where i'm at you know just on the left side of the screen but we on the right side of the screen we have the events list so if you guys do make a donation or if you guys um become a member subscribe all that good stuff it'll show up on that left hand or right hand side of the screen so you guys can kind of get an, an idea of who's been um donating stuff like that and just kind of shout you guys out on the stream um we do have the saint jude's logo on the top just to you know show you guys that this is the the event for the saint jude's for um charity race uh but not only that i'm gonna show you guys the intermission screen so if i ever have to go to the bathroom or if i ever have to just leave the chair for some reason you guys are not gonna be seeing just the chair you guys are gonna be seeing this so give me one second i'll be right back So that's how it's going to look like if you if I ever have to go to the bathroom or if I ever have to leave the room or anything like that. So it gives you guys kind of something to watch instead of just seeing. Be right back. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it. Anyways, that's enough talking about the new stuff for the live stream. But we're going to jump right into it right here, right now. Let's see who else is in here. Zuber, awesome. What's up, man? How's it going? McLaren, hello. How's it going, McLaren? Race the soul in Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Going to be watching this and watching this. Oh, sweet. Mr. Sazen. Awesome. 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 All right. Let me um, get into the lobby right now. So um, I'm actually going to need a little bit of your guys' help, to be honest, because I don't know how to change the BOP. We have to change the BOP manually. 
And unfortunately, I don't know how to do it. Yeah, that's new tech, yes. I'm glad you guys are liking it. Um, yeah, I, I spent a couple hours yesterday just messing around with it, trying to see if I can find like a new layout theme that, that would be actually cool that you guys would like. And uh, this is the one that I came across, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Hopefully everything is working out. I'm crossing my fingers that everything is working out perfectly and that we are not having any audio um, issues, no lag, nothing like that. So just crossing my fingers that everything works out perfect. But if something does, like a problem does come arise, please let me know in the chat. I'll try to fix it as soon as possible. But okay, so I am going to need a little bit of help. Um, can one of you guys explain to me how... Oh, never mind. Yeah, how, can one of you guys help me out with how to set up the BOP? Because I honestly don't know how to set up the BOP. We're supposed to make it 100-100. But I don't know how to do it. So if one of you guys in the chat can help me out here. I've never had to do this uh, manually. So go to car settings, okay? Go into car settings. I've been looking at BOP2. Want practice? Good one. Awesome. Okay, so I'm right here in the car settings. Where do I go from here now, boys and girls? So where it says power and weight. Okay, power and weight. Where's power and weight? Power and weight. Okay, here you go. We're just gonna keep it at 100 and 100. I believe. Let me see. Let me go on the Discord. I'm using the Porsche, so I'm using something different from other people. Everyone's picking their own cars. We got the chance to pick the Porsche, uh, the Audi R8, the, the Nissan <laughs> GTR. If, if you guys know about the Nissan GTR, then yeah, <laughs> you, guys, you guys know no one's going to be picking that car. Uh, we also were given the Toyota TSO30 and the Toyota TSO50. So uh, those are the cars that were given to us for group one. But let me go to the actual Discord so I can see what we are doing for BOP on this car. So, for the Porsche, it says... Oh, just keep it the way it is. Okay, so we, we don't have to do anything with the Porsche. Then we're just going to keep it the way it is. Sweet. Steven, hello. What's going on, my guy? How's it going, mate? <clears throat> Uh, I, I think you can't when it's multi-class. When it's just one class, you can turn on the BOP, but when it's multi-class, you can't do it. So, uh, that's why we have to do it manually. But, alright, we're gonna put in some practice laps here in the Porsche. And, uh, I believe the race is gonna start here in about 20 minutes, so... We only have 20 minutes to, uh... Get into race pace. <laughs> Max Turbo says, Donated $20 to charity. Here's 10 for you, bud. Good luck. I'll be Ferrari. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Thank you, Max Turbo. Like I said, guys, I will be donating um, after the stream $50 to the, to the, uh, to the cause. So um, we'll do that together once the race is over. But we'll see how we do on this race again although it is a charity event i'm taking this like a real race i'm not i don't want to lose you know i want to win this race especially for the children <laughs> but thank you again sir master for the donation the fastest lap was in the gtr <laughs> oh yeah uh unfortunately no i i don't know how to i didn't know how to program it to be honest uh the charity thing I mean uh, I could probably try to do it I can give you guys an update of where it's at Should I could probably let me check right now see if it if it works if I go on this link right here will it show me oh yeah there we go so right now we're at $35 of our $100 goal so you guys are absolutely killing it we're almost halfway there and the, and the race hasn't even started so you guys are just absolutely smashing it and I'll show it to you guys before the race. Just got to get a, a window together. Winner's mentality, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't care if it's a charity or if we're just racing for fun. I'm going for wins. 
We're winning for the children. <laughs> oh, I overdrove that corner. Thank God we have a like a quick 20 minute practice sesh. Like I said, guys, race starts in about 18 minutes. So, in total, I might only have about five laps I can do here for practice. But with the Porsche, the only downside is that the, the fuel is not the best on the Porsche. But the, the handling on it is, is superb compared to some of the other cars. I think the R18 is going to not be that good. Because uh, the battery's gonna run out. I don't know how it will work on this race, but I think the battery's just gonna run out on the R18 after a few laps. And then the Toyota, this car has a higher end top end speed than the Toyota, so. Um, that's why I decided to pick this car compared to the Toyota. Alright, let's put in a lap here. Let's see what we can get for our practice laps. It's gonna be fun though, because it's gonna be multi-class, so we gotta get around. <laughs> we gotta get around all the uh, Group 3 cars. I just wish that you could do like 20 cars. Imagine you could do 20 cars on here. It'd be 10 Group 1, 10 Group 3s. Right now we're on a pretty good lap right here. Mm -mm. <laughs> Phil, hello. Welcome in. Alrighty. Yeah, my fastest lap so far that I've been able to pull was a uh, 122.5 with this car but I did have a little bit of slipstream assistance on one of these straights or actually no I didn't not anything but I didn't I think I just did it off of pure pace oh overdrove that corner it's okay this is why we have practice and if you guys are asking about the uh, event details tire wear is one fuel consumption is one and the only compounds that we're going to be using today is going to be the mediums. Unless we want to use the intermediates in the wets, but it's not going to rain, so. <laughs> you don't have to use that. But yeah, the only compounds that we are given for this race is the mediums. So that will definitely make things a little interesting. Humo Racer. What's going on, mate? When's the race? The race starts in about 15 minutes. So we're going to do 10 minutes of quality and then uh, the two hour race. Right now we're just kind of warming up and practicing. Oh again, she's overdrove that corner. We spun out F already guys. Hopefully we don't do that in the actual race. Oh yeah, it's definitely gonna be a lot. You gonna be kind of busy for the next two hours? Yeah, oh yeah, <laughs> I bet Phil. But again, I just I really wish that they could do twenty cars on these private lobbies. That'd be so awesome. An extra four cars can definitely make a huge difference on an endurance race. But it's fine. We have sixteen drivers. I believe it's gonna be seven LMP ones and nine group threes so oh yeah that that this corner is really really difficult coming off of indianapolis all right here we go now let's try to put in an actual lap thunder's put in a quick lap look at that 322 oh my goodness where did he come from? <laughs> oh no! 
I didn't even see him. Did, did he just ghost out? <laughs> wow. <laughs> that was unexpected. I swear he ghosted out. Oh, yeah, there he is. <laughs> no, Sina, you're fine. You're fine. That was funny. That's, they gave me a heart attack, though. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's focus. Let's refocus. Alright, so I know to work with Thunders. So he put in a pretty pretty good uh, lap there. The thing is, it's going to be uh, 10 minutes of quality, but... Are we doing it by ourselves, or... I don't think you could do just one person quality. If you can, that would be great, but... I think we're all going to be kind of like bunched up together. I definitely don't want to give anybody any slipstream assistance. Oh, Thunder's left. That's another thing we gotta worry about is uh, disconnections. Oh my goodness, look at the pace difference between us and the Group 3 car. Keep it going. <laughs> That's what we're gonna have to deal with, boys and girls, when we're racing. I don't know if you guys put ghosts on for the race, but I'm hoping you guys didn't. It'll just make it that much, that much more entertaining if you guys did not put ghosts. Yeah, probably 20 minutes would have been a little bit better. I don't know. Ghosting is off? Okay, cool, Captain. Yeah, that, if we want to make this feel authentic, definitely we need ghosting off. Alright, this time we didn't spin out. Rebecca, hello. Yeah, the quality will be all together. Thunders, what happened? And Anzo, hello. Hello, my boy. What's up? Oh, into the wall. One thing that's going to be weird is that... There's not going to be any damage. The only time I really do this track with this car is when I'm doing it on uh, iRacing. Alright, let's try to actually put in a lap here. Alright guys, just going to focus a little bit. Hopefully they don't there's no alien cars that just come out of nowhere <laughs> on this section of the track. Missed the apex a little bit right there. Maybe don't have to get on the brakes that much. Oh, you got disconnected. Oof. Ah, oh, King Gears. <laughs> nah, man. I'm pretty sure I would beat you. slow a little slow super yeah <laughs> got a dab on them
Oh, because I, I haven't put in a lap. <laughs> Let me put in a lap and then uh, we'll see how... What the actual difference is. The lap I was actually trying to do, I, I spun out. I don't know if you guys remember that. Alright, now it's not looking too shabby, this lap. This might be a 24. Alright, catching up to Max. Oh, he had to back out. It's gonna be the frustration when it comes to the actual race. So we're gonna have... <laughs> A lot of that. <laughs> no, no, it's a uh, multi-class. So we, uh, we are doing group one and group three. You have the ghost car. <laughs> I don't like you anymore. <laughs> Not just playing. All right. Well, we couldn't get a clean lap in right there because uh, we had some traffic. So let's see what we get for this time. Oh, good, Captain Emerald. I should have break a little bit more into the final chicane. All right, 327. Still nowhere near Thunders, but we did get held up. I'm still trying to figure out how to go onto the straight without losing so much time or so much speed into that that corner. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised either. Alright, how are we looking like? Oh, there we go. Purple. That's what we want to see. Point two. Point two up so far. You prefer the TSO 5 -0? The only thing is that the straight line speed is is garbage right next uh, compared to the Porsche. I don't know how the R18 is. I didn't really practice with it, but I just know that the Porsche is a lot quicker on the straights. Oh, look at that, boys and girls. We're almost an entire second up from our previous lap. See how much more we can improve this lap because we did get caught up right here going to Indianapolis. Still purple. <laughs> Super, thank you so much for the ten dollars and one cent. He said, donate it to the charity, but also wanted to support you as well. Thank you so much. Well, basically, all, all the donations that you guys are going to be putting in for this stream is going to go straight back to the charity. So, you guys are kind of double helping the charity. <laughs> but I appreciate the thought, man. I appreciate the thought. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can nail this. I feel like I didn't get the Porsche S's as good as I wanted it to be. Oh, 
We just lost it on the exit. 323. Probably lost about half a second on the exit, though. actually be a little bit of practice right here when we go down the most on straight all around wide the tire wear in the field is excellent on the TSO yeah but how's the straight line speed though it, that could be a huge game changer and I think we could save some tires we just shift it to one to the rear Probably save some fuel by short shifting if we're in the slip stream. That's something like this. See, we just short shift and we just stay right here on the slip. We should be able to make it to the end of the race, though. Or not to the end of the race, for one stop. Oh, I, did, I definitely did not think about the slip. <laughs> McLaren Fiji, though, ran through the... Uh, I think he ran through the chicane. <laughs> did Uber Austin just call off you? What do you mean by that, Max? Like I said, it, we just gotta do like a fine act between zero and one so that we can preserve the fronts when it comes down to the race. So like somewhere around here, you probably put on one. You go right here, put it on zero. Probably gotta put it on the rear. Bathner, hello. Evening. Thunder's just put in a crazy lap. What? I must have put in a 219. <laughs> I definitely did not make the corner right there. Alright, should I put in another lap here? Qualifying's about to start in 10 minutes, boys. And girls. Are we up? Oh, we actually are up on our time. Cool. Might be because the the fuel is getting lesser, the car is getting lighter, stuff like that. Yeah, I mean, as long as we can make it to the hour mark. We can keep it at one stop, you know what I mean? That's the only thing I'm worried about. If we make it to the hour mark, then uh, that's all we need. There's game thinner, yeah. Let's 
see. Yeah, because 16 times 3, yeah. So we've already done five laps. I think it, how many laps does it take to get to the hour mark? It has to be like, we're doing 320s on average. Um, let's see, 10, 15 would be 45. Probably have to make it like 18 laps. I think 18 laps should be enough to get it to the hour mark. And then right there, we, we decide if we want to change tires or if we don't want to change tires. Let's just see how our tires are by that point. If they look like they're going to be really, really bad, then we'll switch out. But if they look like they can make it to the end of the race, then we'll just uh, keep it till the end of the race. I, I think we'll look at that. We, we've already gone almost six laps, and we still have about 15 laps left. So I definitely will make it over that 18 lap threshold that I was talking about. If we keep running the way we are right now. Ah, oh, just messed up right there again. Really bad exit. Ah, uh, again at 323. 323 is just like, just can't team and escape it on this one. Seventeen laps, so we only have to yeah. So if we're running three twenty ones, all we have to do is just make it three uh, seventeen laps. Yeah, thank you so much for all the likes, guys, and everyone here watching. I know it's a Sunday afternoon. A lot of you guys would rather be, you know, out barbecuing or just hanging out with your folks, but you guys are here watching the stream and supporting a good cause. So I appreciate it so much to everybody who's tuned in and uh, who's hanging out tonight, today, tonight. This morning. Whatever time it is. Alright, so starting in five minutes, boys and girls. The front tires look like they're starting to wear out a little bit. So let's see if we can uh, get some towards the rear here. Luckily, it kind of like fluctuates. <laughs> Thank you, Zuber, for watching. Hope work goes well for you, mate. Uh, there's only one tire compound that is given, Anza. It's going to be the mediums only. Racing mediums. So race should start here soon, in about maybe three minutes. Starting to get this this section down really well. Yeah, we're gonna tap it wide.
Damn, okay. <laughs> three 23s. Three times. Almost two times in a row. Uh, almost three times in a row, but. Uh, that's consistency. Let's have a ride on the exit of the chicane. I don't think we have to really get on the brakes right there. Like, it's just a little lift off. It's gonna be interesting. We'll use that on the, uh, the quality. Alright, we should be starting here in about two minutes, boys and girls. Quality starting in one minute. Here we go. Then we see where we really start out at. Yeah, it's been seven laps, so basically halfway through our first run. And the tires did not look that bad. I don't know if it'll be worth changing the tires. I guess we'll find. Uh, I don't know. It's like an extra uh, what? Five seconds, ten seconds to change tires out. So I guess it depends where we're at on the track. But all right, boys and girls, here we go. We're starting the quality for the charity race. So ten minutes of quality. Let's see what we do here. Here we go. I'm one of the first ones to go out too, sweet. Oh no! <laughs> F. F, boys, F. Oh, uh, we got the pick glitch. Oh wait, we don't have the pitch glitch. What the? Wow, I've never seen it fix itself. That's interesting. I, I thought that was I thought that was the end of it. I've never seen the pick glitch actually fix itself. Yeah, it looks like everyone made it out. There's nobody stuck in the pits. That's awesome. Ah, <laughs> uh, we don't have any any slipstream partners. <laughs> someone take down the quality. Yeah. Seriously, someone please take down the quality positions. So it looks like there's only 12 drivers in this. I thought there was going to be 16. It's all right. So we got blue flags. He said it too soon. <laughs> Trying to save as much of the front tires as we can. Remember, only 10 minutes of qualifying. Oh, F.
I'll try to stay right behind McLaren Fiji. trying to charge up the battery. All right, I think that's good enough. All right, here we go, boys and girls. First quality lap, let's see what we do here. All right, here we go. Oh, my guess stuck behind for Claren Fiji. Give me that slip. Oh, we should be able to get enough here to get past him. Oh, we don't. Thought we did. Oh, that Nissan has so much pop and speed. Oh, he overshot the corner. Oh, there we go. We got open track till the end. <laughs> he has no penalty. There's gotta be no track limits on this race. Yeah, for McLaren. Oh, almost up for me right there. For you guys tuning in right now, this is Quali. Then I should put in a 320. Should look really quick lap. Let's see what we get here for a lap. We did get held up by McLaren. So I think we could get a way better lap than this. There you go. So our last opportunity to put in a Quali.
trying everything I can to not abuse the track limits. Let's see if we get a slip. I don't know if it gives it to us when it's a ghost, but hey, if it does, we'll take it. I right, saying that we're almost a second up on our time. We need to get in four and a half seconds. That's all we gotta do. Four and a half. Yeah, definitely. If you guys want to join in on another event like this, please feel free. Whoa. I don't know if, if Mr. Thunder is driving such a cane. Hope he's not. Ah, oh, okay. I mean, do you think he's really driving to the chicane? I don't. I hope he's not. Oh yeah, there's the formation left, guys. Let's see, will it let us finish this lap? How much extra time will we have? Oh, five minutes extra, okay. Three twenty-three flat again. <laughs> it's the best that we can do right here, but it's gonna be me and Thunders playing Fiji in third right now. Cena in fourth, and we, they call me J in fifth in the uh, group three cars. So it's gonna be five group one cars and then six group three cars. <laughs> Yeah, that's a really fast time, Thunders. I gotta try to see if I can ha uh, hang with you, mate. Alright, guys, remember, formation lap. Oh, <laughs> look at that, boys and girls. Hold up. I want to show you guys something. Uh, let me see if I can show you guys. Um, how can I do this? I don't know if I can do it. But we reached our goal. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw it right there, but we reached our goal of $100, boys and girls. <laughs> awesome 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 yeah no guys we, we we i don't know if we could try to increase this up even more can we donate more if we can that'd be awesome but anyways we reached the hundred dollar goal so round of applause for you guys thank you so much for the ch for uh donating towards a great cause i i think you should be able to donate more if, if we uh if you guys would like to but 
for right now we hit that hundred so we're gonna keep going from here so anything pl uh, plus this is just an uh, additional bonus to help the children boys and girls help the children <laughs> yes Daniel the, don't thank me though it's thank these guys for pleb um, the pleb what, what, is, what do they call themselves the PRS, the pleb, ra the pleb Racing Series, they're the one that organized this together. All this would not have been done without them, so give them a huge shout out as well um, as they did organize this event together. But, we hit that 100. That's awesome. P7 there. <laughs> Good luck, Max. <laughs> Thank you, Blinky. You as well. If you're in uh, Group B. McLaren Fiji's on a suicide. Yeah, he is on a suicide mission. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. I'm hoping there's no glitch. How many people are right now on the, on the B lobby? You're expecting a wreck? Oh, no, Zuber. Okay, awesome. So yeah, if you guys would like to continue to give, Rebecca just said right there that you can continue giving. And uh, although we hit our $100 um, dollar goal, you can still continue adding onto this. So uh, let's do it, boys and girls. Let's do it. Got P4 in room B. Nice. All right, guys. Three, two, one. Here we go. Race bus start. Yes, Carlo. <laughs> Alright, here we go, boys and girls. Definitely don't want to uh throw right here because we're gonna be doing a formation lap. All right, formation lap. Yeah, I know formation lap. So where are we starting off at? Just at the end of chicane, on this, on the next lap. It's actually gonna work well to my advantage because I could just put this on lean. Oh, we're definitely gonna save a lot of fuel here then. All right, wh where does thunders go? Does thunders go? On the outside or on the inside? Now are we doing side by side formation lap or are we just doing single file? How are we doing this? Alright, single file? Okay. Which is cool with me, I'm saving fuel right here. <laughs> I'm saving a ton of fuel. Especially because I got thunder slishing basically. Wait, side by side? Alright. Oh, side by side after first chicken. Okay. Rex, hello. What's going on, mate? Thank you for uh, 
the instruction, Rebecca. Yeah, guys, if you guys want to participate, I, I don't know if they're going to have another event, but if they do have another event, uh, please feel free to follow them on Discord. Uh, maybe one of you guys can put it on, on the chat so you guys uh, can be part of this event next time. Maybe we'll have like four lobbies. <laughs> this, this is a pretty good turnout. We had two lobbies full of people, so I think that's a, that's a win. I'm gonna charge up the battery. <laughs> All right, sounds good, Rebecca. Daniel Carro, thank you so much, mate. What's the deal with Le Mans? Um, I don't know. Just I thought we thought I think it's the best racetrack for uh, multi-class racing. So yeah, I think that's why they picked Le Mans. All right, so side by side after the first chicane. So let's get this ready. So we can do this as perfect as we can. Oh, he lost it. <laughs> Let's go. Already up to P1. Oh, no. <laughs> I think I saw someone go off. Oh, someone's off behind. We just gotta keep it on track. Oh, <laughs> poor Thunders. He lost it right at the start. <laughs> So I can't really show you guys that much turn one action, but we still got a, a very fast McLaren Fiji trying to catch up. Oh, I almost lost on the exit. Just keeping an eye on the map. And how we doing on fuel? Fuel is still pretty good. Oh, but McLaren is gaining so much time with the Nissan. Oh, he's in a slips too. Oh, we got a decent exit. Kind of build ourselves a little gap here. Thunders is back into P3. <laughs> Look at that. Still right behind me. Spaghetti, hello. Oh, here comes McLaren. Oh no, he's got the slip. Oh. A little bit of a tap right there.
It's a three car battle for the lead. Oh, uh, Thunders is right behind. Oh, what a move on the outside. Oh, he caught it with McLaren PG. Side by side, Leon says she came. Is the McLaren Fiji does they get a really good exit? He makes all this time down the straight. So that's where it's gonna be hard to get him. Oh, we're gonna have it wide. Oh, thank you as well, Spaghetti. Thank you for having me, mate. I don't know how long we could maintain this battle. Delta's still in it too. He's like right behind us. Now I'm just fuel saving. Well, I'm a clan You got to really. Oh, make contact with Thunders. Should be able to get him down the straight, though. Oh, really? Wow. Well, hopefully, there wasn't actually a gas leak. This can be very, very dangerous. Oh, there we go. Jeez, look at McLaren. FC Delta is now in the battle. It's a four car battle for the for the lead. <laughs> oh my goodness. I come to McLaren. He's taking a little peek. Trying to see if we can stay with Thunders. As far as staying within the slipstream range. We're still good on fuel. I just got a bad exit. Damn, Thunder's just that much more quicker than me. So he's making up a lot of time. Oh, we lost Delta and McLaren. 
Yeah, they might honestly make an accident at this point. Just trying to stay right behind Thunders. We got better exit than him. We're kind of even on some parts of the track, just some parts he takes it a lot better than I do. Oh, it's still one and a half seconds. It's gonna be interesting once we catch up to the group three cars. We should be catching up to them here in about maybe a couple of laps, a few laps. Oh no! Mistake on my end. My fault. Ah, oh, get back on the track. Come on, come on. F. F on my end. I was I was paying attention too much about the group three cars. Alright, now we gotta try to work our way back up. That was on me. That was on me. Okay, we're getting a lot of time with McLaren. I think those uh, fronts are really starting to go away now. We caught some McLaren. There we go. Oh, we're catching up to LC Delta too. This is gonna be a battle right here for a second. We're actually gaining on thunders here if we work together. So it might actually be a blessing in disguise. We're going to be saving fuel here. Imagine if we could go in the entire race without having to stop. That'd be great. Just one to the rear. Oh, I see. That's a free third place for us. Gary, hello. Yeah, I think our strat here is just going to be to save as much fuel as we can. Maybe we'll have to go for the for the no tires. Oh, Jesus. Don't want to clip that. Oh, here comes Delta.
Whoa! He almost lost it. Yeah, I was gonna see if we could try to push McLaren back up to Thunders. Then McLaren, McLaren's struggling on the exits and on the corners. We've been really inconsistent as well. Oh, Delta break really early. Sorry about that, Delta. Was he flat? I, I don't know if he was flashing to let me go by or if he was just... What was going on? Uh-oh. Turn's going slow. What the heck just happened to McLaren? Oh no, McLaren got disconnected. GT Sport lobbies at their finest. I think he got disconnected. That's why he was slowing down. No, you're good. <laughs> you're good. Oh, man. So it's right now four... LMP1 cars and then six GT3 cars left in the lobby. I'm just imagining though if it was like on GT7 when they have, I think GT7 is going to have 27 cars, right? Or 24 cars on, uh, I don't know why I said 27, 24 cars on private lobby, right? Or maybe 20? They were gonna have to stop. Eventually. I don't know if we can make it. I think to finish the race, because see, we've done six. We've already wasted about 20 minutes. Yeah, I don't think we can make it on a no stop. Oh, okay. It's all good. Azuria. Oof. Ouch, Gary. Ashley, what's up? Is racing here for charity, you know. You know how we do. Yeah, guy, I saw like part of the race. And unfortunately, I, I I got to the part where uh, I think it was Matt jumped the a scar chicane and went into the wall. I was like, oh man, it's unfortunate. Battle for a second still not over though. Delta is still right behind me. Thunder's on the other hand, he's uh he's a little gone. I'm still trying to do everything on my power to save as much fuel as I can.
Oh, the transmission went. Yeah, I want to be in the 22s though. I definitely want to be in the 22s. go up up to tents we're actually getting a little bit on thunders oh, I think it's because he hit traffic we're, we're starting to hit the group three cars all right comes full against our first taste of traffic. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if they're just keeping the 20s either. Dude's quick. There we go. We're half a second up right now. Exactly what we need. Yeah, Thunder's definitely alien. He's just able to break that much later, you know what I mean? Took 40 minutes to replace the transmission. Ah. It's actually pretty quick. In real life, um, endurance racing, can you even replace the transmission like that? Or is it against the rules? Oh, we got Ace. Gave us plenty of room. There you go. <laughs> We're starting to catch us to the good three traffic. Oh, Thunder's lost a lot of time. We just gained almost two seconds on him. Oh, where are we going to catch? Who's this up ahead? Christian? Oh, where are we going to be able to get him at? There we go. That was perfect. Exactly what we needed. Alright, here comes Ray. It's gonna slip. Is Max in first? <laughs> Max is leading the group three cars. Interesting. That's so great. Alright, there's Jay. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that was close. Right, let's see where, where Max goes. I think we're going to get him before the chicane. Just keep your line, Max. Keep your line. There you go. Beautiful. Ah, man. I really do wish... The, we can do like 20 people on this. This would have been uh, amazing if we had 20 cars. But yeah, good job to Sir Max Turbo right now. He is killing it. So it looks like every 30 minutes we're going to be reaching lap traffic. By the way, guys, let me know if there's been any stuttering, if there's been any lag. Just looking at um, YouTube right now, it's telling me that the current bit rate is too low, so I don't know. 
Oh yeah, Thrace will definitely be more epic. I'm telling you, multi-class is so much fun. Especially when you have a when you have a lot of cars in the race, it just makes it that much more uh, more fun. Cause it's super scary. <laughs> Looks fine. All right, awesome. Yeah, it's super scary once you start catching up to these. Uh, when you when you're the fast driver, it's not as scary. But when you're when you're in the slower cars, yeah, it's 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 a little scary. So how are we looking like right now on time? Or I don't feel, I mean, so good. Oh, we actually ran our fastest lap, sweet. Tab it wide. I think that would have been a penalty in uh I don't know if in real life it would have been a penalty or if we would have just gone launched off straight to the barrier or to the trees. Oh, uh, so the motor and the trans are off limits. Interesting, Gary. Yeah, I guess you could you could kind of cheat that way if you're if you're doing like real life endurance racing because you could just midway through the race just change to the transmission or the mm, actually no because would it really would it really be worth it you're like 45 cause you're gonna lose about 45 minutes you know what I mean I don't know if you can make up that much time in a race just by replacing a transmission or an engine. Run 25 hours here. <laughs> oh, Thunder Hill Raceway? I, I don't know much about Thunder Hill Raceway, to be honest, Gary. Enlighten me. What is Thunder Hill Raceway? I'm still trying to catch up to this Thunder's guy up ahead. We're able to build a gap away from Delta, that's good. But Thunders is still so far up the road. He's just trying to keep it in the 23s. This guy's keeping it in the 20s. I don't know how he's doing it. All right, everything's going well, Spaghetti. Uh, we're down to 10 cars right now. A couple people got disconnected, but. Yeah, so far everything's been good. Just trying to catch back up to Thunders. And I've been putting in some ridiculously quick lap times. There we go. 321, that's what we want to see. Come on, can we can we find some pace here? Unless if he's saving fuel now. <laughs> I 
house. It's over 115. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for everyone who's donated, everyone who's participated in in this. It's awesome, awesome. Think about it, 100 was just the the goal, and we already surpassed it. We're not even halfway through the stream yet, halfway through the race. So all you guys, everyone who donated, give yourselves a pat on the back. You guys have been absolutely brilliant. Five mile road course in the USA, home of the longest endurance race for GT style cars. Oh, I didn't know that. I have to, I have to look at it. De Le Mans. <laughs> yeah, I'll have, remind me at the end of the stream to check it out, mate. Ah, I just don't know where I can pull out another half a second. I mean, I'm pushing, guys. I'm pushing. I'm just not getting anywhere. So let's put this, uh... So we can put... Ah, do we need to put more towards the rear? I think we need to put a little more rear brake. Hmm. Now we'll just keep it at plus one. I think plus one will be alright. Now I think about it. Doesn't seem like it's too big of a difference. We still gotta figure out when we're gonna pit. See, 13 laps from now, so we we'll probably have to pit around lap 22, lap 20. I think lap 22 should be all right. We should definitely be able to make it past our mark on lap 22, so we don't have to worry about putting in a full tank of gas or fuel. another 121 or 321 I can feel the tires are starting to fade a little bit Wow, really Gary, that is, that is crazy. Yeah, that, that is a, that is a fantastic story Gary. Can you, can you share more about that? If, if you feel comfortable mate, cause that, that is a phenomenal story. So we're going to be catching up to the uh, the back of the group three cars here in about 10, 15 minutes once again. It costs the family zero to take their kids there. Oh, that's, that's great.
Oh, McLaren, you got disconnected because of the Wi-Fi? Oh, a little mistake right there. I'm telling you guys, I'm telling you, I'm pushing, I'm pushing. Alright, 322.7. We're, we're getting a little slower now. Yeah, to be fair, McLaren, that was a really great race we were having. It's like <laughs> one of us would be able to get away, but then you'd just come right back. Okay, so they said he was diagnosed at 14 with a migraine disorder that the local doctor never could pin down. He sent it to St. Jude's to work up and they found a super rare cancer. And oof. And they operated on him. And they were able to give him an extra 17, or not 17, an uh, extra three years. Let me give you guys an update where we're at on our goal. So our goal is 100. Last time I checked, we were at 100. We're still at 115, which is great. Let's see by the end of the stream if we can double that. That goal amount. Have you tried uh, using the Ethernet, McLaren? They sent him down, told him what the deal was, and my cousin told them to use him as a lab rat so others might be cured. Ah, oh. Shit. <laughs> he had four rounds of high dose chemo. Ah, oh, fuck. Damn, Gary, that. <laughs> I'm about to cry here on the stream. That's, 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 hard. that's so touching. I mean, that's, that's a lot of bravery right there that your cousin did to, uh, you know, try something new. You know, new, new form of, of chemo on him. It's a lot braver than, than a lot of people. I'll tell you that. So I can't, I can't imagine that those four rounds of chemo were, were easy. Let's see if we can get around full against.
Oh, you've been using the Ethernet the entire time? Okay. Hmm. I'm not sure they may. I think at this point you just call the cable provider or your internet provider. Nice, Gary. Well, if his sacrifice, well, I don't know, it's considered, because, uh, I don't know if this is too personal, Gary, but is he still, is he still around? If so, even, even then, like, I guess he would still call it sacrifice. There's no sacrifice, you know, hopefully could have led towards finding some type of, of, of cure or something to, to help other kids. You know, that's, that's a really self-active, or that's a really big act of bravery that um and a lot of people would not do which is this is amazing to hear that he did it my dad at age 18 wow yeah well you said three years he was able to at least an extra two, you know what I mean? That was about eight years ago. Ah, oh, that's a that's a that's a touching story, mate. <laughs> like I said, I'm over, I'm over here about to cry in the middle of this race because <laughs> of that. Yeah, he was... He, not that he must have been a brave kid. He was a brave kid. Because no no 13-year-old should be going through something like that. We're stuck behind these guys real fast. Get around Christian. Probably wasn't the best spot to try to overtake him. He called three times, McLaren. Oof. Yeah, at that point, you just tell him, alright, we're switching. See, stories like that, that's just, uh, I'm really happy that, you know, uh, that this money's going to go towards a good cause. Because I, I understand how expensive it could be for medical, um, yeah, I don't want to say medical procedure, but just for medical attention for, for anything. It can, it can rack up the bill really, it can rack up a bill really, really quick. So... So I'm saying I'm really I'm really ha glad that this is gonna go towards a really good cause. All right, we we're starting to catch up to some more traffic. I actually caught up to these guys a lot quicker than last time. Oh, and Max Turbo lost the lead. Ray's leading now. <laughs> Coloth. Hello. Thank you so much for a donation, mate. Everyone say hello and thank you to Koloth, guys. Wow, that's crazy. 
Yeah, he just, just looked like an average teenager just with no hair. Yeah, I bet I, I don't I don't know the severity of the chemo, but uh, I'm pretty sure yeah. Uh, after doing it so much and with the cancer, it's really difficult to do sports. I got more into hunting and fishing since lived down the country. Oh, okay. How's the gap now? Uh, it's getting bigger. <laughs> I've been trying to run him down, but he's he is a tough one. Once this pit stop starts, I might have to adjust the pedals because my right foot is starting to get a little tired. I bet the chemo was very taxing. I can't, I can't even imagine though how much you, it must be on a person's body. There we go, boys and girls. 165. Thank you so much. I guys have been absolutely awesome. And then remember, Rebecca, I'm gonna donate 50, so we're gonna hit that 200. So wherever we're at right now, add another 50. So, there we go. Yeah, we already got past the pulse we get. We're, we're still not even halfway through the race. We already passed our goal. Oh, I ran a 326 because so we got stuck behind the group 3 cars. I was like, why did I run a 326? Alright, let's put towards the rear more. <laughs> You're welcome, guys. But thank you also for putting it together.
In chemo cycle, he was exhausted with 90% energy back on. Oh, interesting. Actually, a lot. If you feel 90% back, I mean, that's. <laughs> It's actually really, really good. Thank you, Gary. <laughs> yes, we get that. Definitely, that's awesome. It really was a really good turnout, to be honest. There's a lot of people that joined. We had to make two separate lobbies. That's how big of a turnout it was. So, that's awesome. Look at that, we're, we're just gaining more and more on our time. Oh, tap it's early. Ten weeks on and off. Uh, on and twelve off. Okay. I think we're about to overlap Cinna. Thank you, Mr. Assassin. Yeah, I'm trying to hit. Let's see if we can consistently keep hitting the 20s. And I'll be able to get around Cinna here. Oh, yeah, he gave it to me. Oh, they're already coming in. Call me Jay's in the pits. Where are we at on fuel? We still got about five laps left on fuel, so. Be interesting when we come in. But then do we do we take tires, guys, or do we just What do we do? Do we just only take fuel or do we take tires? Tires aren't too bad right now, to be honest. We're sitting in a pretty comfortable P P2. Just 
just to just do both to be safe. Okay, we'll do. Alright, I'll take the tires. I'll take the tire and the fuel. Alrighty, we're we're at the hour mark. We hit our goal. I said we need to make it by the hour mark without having to come into pits, and we did it. So now, when do we got to come in? That's the good question. That is the million dollar question right there. Because we got five laps left, so I'm assuming lap 23 will. No, lap 22 will have to come in. Yeah, lap 22 we're going to have to come in. Thunders isn't a lot more tires though. <laughs> Gary said, because the stints are so long, you do not want tires going off halfway through. Yeah. That wouldn't be good if the tires do go, wouldn't go off. Oh, we're just starting to catch back up to the, uh, to group three cars. Thunder can only get fuel. Some of the other group three cars are starting to come in. Turbo's in, Max Turbo's in. Not sure Thunder got the memo. <laughs> group three racing is health. <laughs> nice, Max. Oh, Thunder's is in. Wow, he did not save any fuel. Look at how much more fuel we have compared to him. Oh, we're not tapping wide. Whoops. Oh, yo, fuck. How do we save so much fuel? Flash dagger, hello. Yeah, not sure how much how Thunder was able to save so or how we already saved so much fuel compared to Thunders. Still got like three more laps of fuel left. I 
first hour of the fuel burn was 76. So all we need is 76, 78. Six, you should do it to the end? Okay. So take a lunge on the inside of Max. We're gonna have to overtake these guys twice. So we just overtook them right now. But then we're gonna have to re overtake them when we come into the pit. Bitch out my inner Rory. <laughs> No, he he had nine percent of fuel left, or twelve percent of fuel left. He probably was trying to go for the undercut, but to be honest, it, it might be better just staying out. I feel like I've been running a lot quicker lap times staying out. Almost as if the overcut is actually better. I don't know. Just keep an eye on the gap between us and Thunder. By the way, 51 likes. Thank you guys so much for those 50 likes. Helps us out in the YouTube algorithm. And helps me out just knowing that you guys enjoy the stream. So much appreciated, boys and girls. Much appreciated. So it's been a really good stream, to be honest. We've had some good racing. We've met our goal on donations. We met our goal on likes. It was a huge turnout. I gotta say, this is a successful, successful uh, charity race, to be honest. So far, it looks like we're still pulling away from Thunders. Like, we're able to kind of build a little gap from him. I really do think that the overcut's a little bit better. Just because how much the fuel weight difference makes such a big impact on uh, lap times. Oh, oof. he was able to cut a lot from the chicane. Right as I said that. Alright, we should have to come in in two laps. Let's have it wide. Yeah, 51. 54. Oh, thank you guys so much for the likes. Yeah, it's like the first half of the lap, I started making up a lot of my time on Thunders. But it's when we get to the final sector, where he's making up... Sorry, where he's making up the time back. Keeping an eye on the difference between mine and his time right now. Still 8.8 .8 seconds, dropping down 8.6, 8.7. So like it's bouncing all over the place, but it is starting to get smaller. I do have to admit that it is getting a little bit smaller. Cause uh the gap last lap was at nine. Now it, it's at eight. Oh 
I'll jump back up to nine. Ah, do we take tires? I don't know. Am I using hybrid boost? Um, I don't. I think it just does it on its own, to be honest. I don't know if you can see on the bottom left. There's a battery right there. That's that's just using it automatically. We're not coming in this lap, but we're coming in next lap. So on lap 22, that's when we're gonna come in. Oh, we just ran our fastest lap of the race. Awesome. I think Thunder just ran at 318. Wow. <laughs> I forgot about that Hal. Or Hal. Call me J says definitely take tires. Okay. Fine. We'll take tires. Or do we just not come in at all? <laughs> Screw it. We're doing a no stop. Even though we only have a lap and a half left of fuel. <laughs> Actually, you know what? We might have to come in this lap. Let's see right now. Let's see how much fuel I got left. Let me cross the uh, pit entrance. Marcus, hello. He says, hi all. Like dropped in the way in. Thank you so much, mate. Thunder's just catching up. I think we're just gonna have to come in this lap. I don't think we can make it another lap. I'm scared. I feel like I can see him in the in the rear. $200 raise. We doubled our goal, boys and girls. Thank you so much. Awesome. Awesome, guys. That is awesome. Look at that. Oh, right, I hit, right as I hit the wall. <laughs> yeah, we're not coming this lap. Sixty-five percent fuel, four tires, a tear-off, and fresh water bottle. <laughs> All right, sounds good. <laughs> there we go, and we're in, boys and girls. All right. Let's see how much fuel do we need? Probably not gonna need that much. Oh, I just heard thunders pass. Let's see. Ten. Probably only need like fifteen laps of fuel. So we don't need to, we don't need to uh, fill it up all the way. Hey Dub, thank you so much for the five dollars. 
Thank you, my good sir. All right, here we go. Just need five. That much. Should be good to the end. Forty-six minutes left, boys and girls, in this race. Yeah, it should definitely do. Rip, get that win. <laughs> going for it, K. I'm going for it. Thirty-eight seconds is the gap right now from us to Thunders. Thank you, Zuber. Hit my dogs. <laughs> oh no, they're crying. Yeah, we should we should definitely have enough fuel to make it to the end of the race. Even if we gotta do an extra lap. See every three laps, it's a minute. So let's see. Uh, let's see. We do an extra fifteen laps. Fifteen divided by three. That's five minutes. So that's an extra minute. Yeah, th we should be fine. Oh wow, we have so much more grip. It's crazy how much grip we have. Put down to one. <laughs> As the wise and powerful said, use the Schwartz. Yes, exactly what Rebecca just said. So I have plenty of time to donate to an amazing cause. Like I said, the fact that we already doubled our our goal, that is absolutely awesome. I'm gonna be catching up to some some of these guys up here soon. Just 
to where we are on fuel. Yeah. We'll make it to the end. We're actually gaining time on Thunders. Because Thunders was about 38 minutes up the road. And now it's dropped down to 37. Or not 38 minutes. What am I saying? 38 seconds up the road. Now he's only 37 seconds up the road. So the gap is getting smaller. I just don't know if we ran out of time. That's gonna kill us. It's gonna give us about half a second. <laughs> the bonk tax. What was the bonk tax for today? I, I, the bonks had to be up at least up over 60. Am I right? Am I right? <laughs> There's a lot of bunks. Yeah, he must have listened to that change tires. Who knows? Imagine if tire wear was uh, times five or times six. Oh, oh my goodness. Yeah. I think the moment I tuned into the end of the race, Ollie had just gotten turned by a Ferrari. <laughs> Speaking of Ollie, how's it going, mate? We were just talking about the race and how. You guys might owe bonk taxes for the donation. <laughs> At least that was Gary's idea. Oh, fool again. Oh, where's he going? Oh, he lost it. Uh, yes, my legs are starting to get exhausted there. I don't know if you can see it. Like, I've been, I've been using my left leg for the throttle down the straights. Yeah, it was a bad time. <laughs> how many how many incident points did you guys get by the way, Ollie? I, I got towards the end of the uh, of the stream where you got taken out by the Ferrari and Parabolica. That was an interesting moment that happened right there. <laughs> yeah. Holly heard his name and he, he just like a signal he came <laughs> Oof I can't believe how quick Thunders is. Thunders is just pulling away every single corner. Done. <laughs> the bat signal equals all his name. <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're right.
Oh no. Oh, that was a little mistake on my end. We're gonna tap it wide on the exit of the chicane. Nothing too crazy though. Could have been worse. It could have been like off of most on corner. The bonk tax has been paid. <laughs> oh yeah, somebody definitely go throw some cones. Just throw some uh just throw some beers at him. Nah, Thunders has been has been putting in a, a great race. He messed up in the beginning, he spun himself out right off the chicane, then he gets down the straight, but uh, other than that, he's been putting in a hell of a race. No, yeah, Thunders is up there, Ollie. This guy has been flying. I was hoping that I could at least compete with him for a win. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely this guy is not human. I, I think I've raced against Thunders like a few times. I just I don't remember exactly how fast he was or not. Oh, he wasn't. Yeah, we have official proof now that Thunders is uh, is an alien. Oh, he's a legend, huh? No, yeah, in the beginning it was close when we had, uh... Because he, he had spun out. If you go back to the first lap, he spun himself out, leading us down the grid, or down the line to the start, finish line. And so he got, he got the motor all the way down to fifth. And then it was basically a four-car battle for the lead for about a lap, lap and a half. And once he got ahead, he just, he, there was no looking back. He was just pulling away every single corner. It's kind of how he's doing right now. Right now he's just on coast. Coasting mode, cruise control. Oh, we, we caught Christian at a really bad place. Here's the interesting part. We're gonna catch up to the lap traffic once again. I gotta admit though, this this track on this game feels so good. Like when you hit all your marks, and you just hit every single apex, it just feels it just flows really well. The faulty streamer has to look, yeah. There you go, put two gals in the beginning holding a bucket of ice. <laughs> That'll definitely take down thunders. Even, he won't even know what happened. Just boom, straight into the gravel trap. I should help Max get to back up to P5. Where is he at right now? I don't know where he's at on the road. Is that him over up here? Is that him? No. Yeah, it is him. I Man, I could try to give him the best of a toe as I can. Oh, jeez. 
Come on, Max. Yeah, I, like I said, boys and girls, when, when, when they add more drivers to these private lobbies, these multi-class races, if they do them on daily racing, that'd be great, but for sure on private lobbies, they will be just awesome. Like, imagine 20, 24 drivers on here. That'd be, that'd be great. I know it's not gonna be on the same level as I racing, but... You know, you'll still be able to have a, a proper multi-class race. With a decent amount of cars. Now that's a series that I wouldn't mind popping on, or a league. Imagine bump drafts into fish. Yeah, it was just bump drafts. Uh, Max the entire way. Flash Tiger, welcome, welcome. Again. I know you were here a little earlier. I think that was all the group 3 traffic, unless... who's that up here? I'm catching up to so much, don't know who it is. Shouldn't be a group 3 car, it's probably, uh, Senna. That we're catching up to. Somebody go send a message to Thunder telling him that, um, that he left his lights on in his car or something like that. I was trying to think of the most, um, not offensive way to, to get Thunders to get off of his chair. I think seeing lights, his lights are on is, would, would definitely get him out of his chair to try to go turn him off in his car or something. <laughs> Thunders left us up. There you go. Fuck it. <laughs> Thunders, you left your, your love oven on me. If you're watching the stream, you gotta go turn it off. But, but, you gotta turn, you gotta turn it off, and you gotta spin around ten times, and then you gotta go back to your chair. <laughs> so the only way the oven will turn off. Who are we catching up to? Is that Cinna up there? That we're catching up to? It has to be him. That we, we already got past all the group 3 cars. See, so yeah, I see a car up ahead. I just can't make what kind of car it is. You tell me left to so <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, you left your toilet seat up, mate. Your wife's not going to be happy. <laughs> She fell. She fell in the toilet, mate. She fell in the toilet. Did, you see what she caused? You you left the toilet seat up, and she fell in the toilet. Now you have to help her get out, and then you have to clean her up. I think that should take a at least longer than a minute. Crimes against humanity. I'm telling you. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, that is Cinna. Oh. 
Oof. Jeez. Just missed the break in a little bit. He's less efficient chips burning in the microwave. You know what? My sister has done that. I'm gonna give you guys a little story time here. I came home one day to smell burning plastic. If you guys know what burning plastic smells like, it just smells disgusting. That's the best way I can explain it. Um, but I came. Oh Jesus, Cinna! <laughs> I came home to burning plastic smell, and asked my sister, "What did you do? Why does it smell like?" Like something just absolutely just leaked into the floors or something like that. And she told me she was trying to microwave French toast, but she read the instructions wrong. It said for microwave, you have to microwave them for about a minute, two minutes. She read the oven instructions where it says to keep them in there for 13 minutes. So she microwaved the French toast and she put, for some reason, a plastic cover peace out Sina. <laughs> a plastic cover on top of it put 13 minutes and after like the 10th or 11th minute the plastic was just boiling and just turning black and just melting onto the french toast so for the whole entire day i think two days actually it just smelled like burnt plastic she's lucky she didn't burn the house now but ever since then i don't trust her with the microwave <laughs> Poor Sina. If someone could do the calculations to see if we'll make it to the end of the race, please do that, because now I'm starting to get a little bit worried here. I mean, if, even if we have to come in, we got a pretty good gap from Delta, uh, Delta, so. Yeah, she made plastic souffle. <laughs> I mean, how... How do you... <laughs> she never did it again, thank God, but, like, what... What would possess you to think that putting in plastic in the microwave for longer than 10 minutes would result in a good idea? <laughs> or putting anything in the microwave for over 10 minutes. I don't think... I can't think of anything that uh, could be put in the microwave for over 10 minutes. Unless you're like defrosting. Maybe. I don't know. I've never defrosted anything in the microwave. Well than that, the most you should put something in a microwave is at least only three minutes. Three, four minutes if you're, if you're making like popcorn or something like that. Well, that was terrible. Bradley, thank you. I don't know what, what the nice job was for, but thank you. One thing is for sure, we are putting in consistent laps. Look at that, 322, back to back to back. They don't call me consistent PX cam for nothing. Even though I don't think anybody calls me that. Oh yeah, burn plastic definitely st stays around forever. Rebecca, it sounds like you have experience with that. Care to share? <laughs> you cook rice in the microwave for more than 10 minutes? Is that even legal? Strike Eagle? <laughs> Can he even do that? <laughs> That's where I'll call the cops. <laughs> oh yeah, burnt popcorn smells disgusting. I think that's the worst. Is when you make popcorn and you think you put it in there for just the, amount, the right amount of time, but then when you open it up, it's all burnt. And then you just wasted a good bag of popcorn. That's that's the absolute worst. So then you gotta put in a new one in. Oh, first, first world problems, I'm telling you guys. Just absolute, accidentally just overcooking your popcorn. 
<laughs> I would offend some people if they heard that. <laughs> oh my goodness. She set she set them on fire. What the what what's even can biscuit? I've never heard of that. Can biscuit? <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure it's against the law. <laughs> Popcorn 2.05. You cook McFlurries in the microwave? What are McFlurries? Aren't isn't that like a an ice cream from McDonald's? Like ice cream with with uh, M and M's and vanilla ice cream, something like that. And it's been a while since I've I've had a Mc, uh, McFlurry from McDonald's. <laughs> nice, Puma, nice. Alright, guys, so now we know if Strike Eagle makes. Ooh, oh, oh, my goodness. That was close. That was way too close. Um, <laughs> I lost my train of thought. Uh, oh, okay. If, um, Strike Eagle makes rice and oven once again, we're gonna call the cops on him. Cause that's definitely against the law. <laughs> fish and chips in Scotland is also called fish supper. Interesting. Interesting. Fish and chips is just fish and french fries, right? Like, um... What do you call it? It's not grilled. Fried. It's fried. Fried fish and uh, french fries. Correct? Or am I completely off? By the way, shout out to everybody for the 60 likes. High five, or not high five, but round of applause for you guys as I almost lose my steering wheel. I'm gonna check the uh, where we're at right now on the donations for the fundraiser. Let's check $210. Awesome, guys. Doubled, doubled our goal of $100. So $210. I'm gonna be donating 50 afterwards. It's gonna go up to 260. Can't we three times it? $40 and we three times the goal, guys. We got less than 20 minutes left in this race. If you guys wanna donate, feel free to hit that link in the description. It's gonna be the first thing in the description or in the chat. I have it pinned on the top. Just click on that blue um, chat box and it should show you the link right there. But well, awesome, awesome work, everybody. Awesome work. Almost lost right there. Up in Molson Corner. Popping fresh from the Pillsbury. Uh, I don't remember that to be honest, mate. I don't. Think your fries are called chips? Oh, okay. McLaren, welcome back. Yeah, I guess they would call it steak fries here. So french fries are just small f fries and then big ones are... Uh, um, chips. Take like wedges? I don't know. I don't know.
say chips are the best, yeah. Oh, yeah, I remember that. They, he would giggle whenever they push on his button. Do they even still make those type of commercial with the Pillsbury Doughboy? Like, I, I haven't seen any with him on it. Or did he did he get canceled too? Did he get involved in some allegation? <laughs> he got canceled. No more Pillsbury Doughboy. That's what you guys call them in Canada. Interesting. They don't poke him anymore. Aw. That's like that's the whole point of the Pillsbury Doughboy. You gotta poke him in the stomach, make him giggle. I heard a story that somebody t thought that the defen defrosting icon in the microwave oven remains freezing and made a mess with a pack of ice cream sounds t <laughs> Hey, hey, I, I, I'm, I'm just gonna say I can see how it can be interpreted wrong. Just that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I just get confused with the Doughboy and the Michelin guitar guy. <laughs> yeah, I got caught with the Swiss Miss girl up behind the barn. <laughs> no, no. No, don't do that to my Pillsbury Doughboy. <laughs> my childhood. <laughs> oh, no. Puma, they might be, yeah, they might be related. The Michelin tire man. I didn't realize how long the Michelin Tire Man has been around for. It's actually been in their uh, their ad campaigns for a very long time. Also, for as long as this race has gone. I mean, I kind of have to be a little bit happy with myself that Thunders isn't a full entire minute away from me. We're still under a minute from him. If you go back to the AT hundreds and GT Sport, he looks really creepy. Yeah, I, I don't doubt that. But back then, that was like the normal. By the way, where was Michelin manufactured at initially? Wasn't it French? Is it a French tire company, uh, company, or is it German? So I think I think it was in Europe, right? Where they uh, did the Michelins. I haven't seen a Cocoa Puffs commercial recently. Do they still have a uh, the the cuckoo bird? This cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. It's a, it's intense right now for three. Yeah, it's French. Okay. Yeah, I was thinking Michelin was was French. Oh, someone spun out. Someone spun out. I just saw that in the minimap. Hopefully I can catch up to see the battle of group three. The group three lead. Max, Jay, and Ray are battling. <laughs> the Applejacks commercial? <laughs> oh, when they had... When they had the cinnamon stick man and the... Uh, and the bad apple. The Jamaican's like, uh, here I come, my young Sunny man. Ah, <laughs> oh, those are great. All right, do we help out Max or who? Who's that, right? In seventh, do we try helping them out? If we can give him a little push at the exit. 
I'm trying to help him out. Just see where you're at, Max. Just see where you're at. Just give him a little boost. I don't know if that helped him or hurt him. <laughs> oh, this. I'll take it nice and easy through here. I kind of have nowhere to go. Probably get him on the straight. There we go. Really couldn't go anywhere right there, going into Indianapolis. Sean, hello! Welcome in. Pump Ray. <laughs> no, we're not gonna do that. <laughs> the most I will do to help that fight is just help out Max, just catch up to him. That's it. I let them do their run their lines as well. I didn't get in the way, so I didn't want I didn't want to screw up that battle. Ah, uh, I kinda wanna go back there though and just watch it. Please, for the content. <laughs> for the culture. <laughs> you gotta punch out ready for the culture. Oh no, there goes our... Remember how I was saying that we were gonna finish within a minute of Thunders? Oh, well, we just lost that. Messing around with the group three cars. <laughs> He deserves it. Uh, Sin is just retired. Hey, McLaren, if you're in the chat, tell Thunders he left his, his oven on. Biddenburn is the Michelin man's name. I didn't know that. Time to drink. <laughs> Interesting. But he he's a man made out of tires. How can he drink? You tell me that. Got you. <laughs> Thank you, McLaren. <laughs> it's our it's our final it's our final shot. Oh, I thought you told him right now. Yeah, it's our, it's our final shot to try to get Thunders to leave his chair. I tell you, you just gotta tell Thunders that he left his oven on. He's gonna think about it. Then he's gonna get into a mistake because he's like, oh, snap. Did I leave the oven on? And he's gonna, and there you go. Then he's gonna run to his oven. Check to make sure that, uh,. That's not on. And then we catch up and then we win. It's genius. It's genius. I mean, how, how can it go wrong? You know what I mean? How can it go wrong? Let's go! 240. 10 more guys and we hit the... I'm going to hit 300. And we got 8 minutes left in the race. Let's go. I've been having a lot of fun with you guys. I got to admit, I've been having a lot of fun. Guys, I've been keeping this really entertaining. I really do wish I could watch the, that battle for first in the group three. Sin has complained about his left leg. Oh, I'm complaining about my right leg. My right leg is definitely feeling it. These long straights.
Look at that, guys. 322, 323. Like, I'm telling you, we've just been hitting 22s consistently. I don't think you're getting more consistent than that. Oh, I ran a tad bit wide. Oh, well. Got a little bit of dirty tires. No, and Thunders is now an entire minute ahead of me. Yeah, Kutsky, it's a it's a charity event. This one. Yeah, we need a group three cam. It's actually not that late. That was a lot later. It's only 2.20 right now in my time. That was already like 3 o'clock. 3, 4 o'clock. I know what I'm doing after this. I'm gonna eat some food. So I'm starving. The Michelin man is 123 years old this year. He's 1, 2, 3 years old this year? Is that what you're saying, Gary? Um, I think it is possible to to host a broadcast. Jay has his wipers on. <laughs> That's funny. All right, so is this next lap going to be considered the last lap? No, it's not the final lap yet. So we still got two laps left. We should have enough to make it to the end. Wait, are we going to have enough? Wait a minute. Because this won't be the final lap. Next lap will be the final lap. No, we should have enough. We should be able to make it to the end. No, no, Gary. It's 1, 2, 3. He's going to be 1, 2, 3 years old. Oh, we've caught up to group three cars again. Well, we should be able to make it. So we got. So this is gonna be the lap, the ultimate lap, basically, and then we're gonna have our final lap. You saw right there, we have enough to make it for two laps. So we should be able to make it to the end. Well, guys, these uh, past two hours, almost actually two hours still on the dot, actually three hours on the dot, um, have been really, really fun. Really appreciate all you guys tuning in and hanging out. For a great cause. Like I said, I know it's a Sunday. You guys could be doing other stuff right now. But you guys decided to come hang out with me. And everybody else here running this uh, great charity uh, event that was put together. By the Pleb Racing Series. For, uh, for charity. For support of the St. Jude's um, Children's Research Hospital. Yeah, just want to say a huge massive thank you for all you guys for tuning in and uh, all you guys that donated a massive thank you to you guys as well You guys give yourselves a pat on the back Reached our goal doubled our goal. We might even triple our goal 
um, by the time this race is over. Uh, so, just want to say a huge thank you because of that. Okay, there we go, guys. So, one minute left in the race. By the time Thunder's past the start finish line, it should say final lap. So, let's see what we're looking at here. Chase Fuel is at 7%. Oof. <laughs> thank you, Gary. Like I said, these, these events are, are, are a lot of fun. I mean, I know we're coming in here to have fun, but I still want to win. You know, it still comes with that winner's mentality, but it's just the, the meaning behind the event and how we're doing all this just so we can try to help change somebody's life. It's just, it means a lot. You know what I mean? Especially with Gary, when, when you told me about that story about your cousin, that, that, like I said, that really hit me right here. I was almost about to start tearing up here and start crying on stream because it, it really did touch me. So, just it makes these events that much worthwhile. And there you go, we got our final lap, boys and girls. So, when we cross the start finish line this time around, it'll be our last lap here. Yeah, it's definitely a great turnout. Oh, we didn't—we didn't just smash the donation goal. We—we we obliterated that donation goal, guys. Oh wow, that was it! <laughs> I thought there was more. <laughs> oh no, I thought we had one more lap. Oh well, that was a race, guys. That—that <laughs> that caught me off guard. I was not expecting that. I was expecting another lap. Oh well. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was that was a race. Jesus, that was that took a lot out of me. Oh, but that means I that it's saying that I finished the lap down because I wasn't able to finish. That's interesting. And subscribing to the channel is always 100% free. <laughs> yes, that is very true, Gary. If you guys really enjoyed what you guys watched. Well, uh, feel free to hit that subscribe button down below. Turn that red button into a gray button. It really helps us out. Captain Hemerill says, $325 raised so far since there's another donation link in the... Oh, interesting. Okay, so 325 Look at that, guys. 325 We absolutely... Mm, mm, obliterated. There you go. I was going to say the wrong word. But we absolutely obliterated the goal, guys. So, pat, pat on the back. Hi, man, round of applause for all you guys. Technically, Cinna finished first. He already had the chickens besides his name. Yeah. <laughs> true, true that. Cinna did finish first. Yeah, it was definitely a close race with Thunders. <laughs> it was a close race for the beginning, though. The beginning was a... It was really, really close in the beginning. Yeah, Max tried. Where, where are we at right now? I'm just waiting for the results for the group threes. There you go. Group one is done. So it's Thunders with the win. Me in second. FC Delta in third. And Cinna in fourth. Probably, uh, I don't know where McLaren would have finished that, but he would have finished somewhere in between third and fourth probably. Or second. I don't know. But, oh, there we go. Call Me J wins the group three. Ray Rivera in second. Or Ray Riff in second. Max Turbo in seventh. Ace Hendricks looks like he's going to finish in a uh, eighth, which is uh, fourth in their class. So podium is, is, they call me Jay, Ray, and Max Turbo. And then we got Ace coming home in fourth, and then Christian in ninth. And then Fool again in tenth. You know who would obliterate everybody. <laughs> nice. I don't think anybody punted Ray. I'm sorry. Sorry, mate. Jay made it with 1% of fuel. Oof. Oof. <laughs> right? <laughs> he almost got P2, but hit the wall. Yeah, what a close race. That's that's awesome. That's good that you guys had a great race for, uh, for Group 3. Yeah, definitely well done to everybody. I wonder if uh, the Group 
B race is still going on. If it is, let me know how that one's going. <laughs> I thought Max had it too. I tried helping Max. Max, I tried helping you, mate. I tried giving you a bump draft. Yeah, GG to everybody, definitely. Two hours around Le Mans is not an easy task to do. It's very difficult. <laughs> no, thank you, Rebecca. Thank you to to um to the Pleb Racing Series for putting this together. I said none of this would have happened without you guys. Go second place, boys and girls. Ah, <sighs> I really wanted to win, though. I, I'm not gonna lie, I did want to win, but all good. You congratulate, um. Thunders and they call me Jay because they both won their uh, class. There you go. Oh, yeah, that was definitely great racing. Colors win. Hello. Yeah, GG to everyone. <laughs> all right, sounds good, Rebecca. Thank you. Tell Jay I said thank you. But alrighty guys, uh, let me see if I can do the donation right here. Um, 240, awesome. Uh, can I do it? I'm, I'm trying to see if I can do the donation here without giving you guys any information. Hmm. So I will do the donation and I'll put it up on Discord. Just to show you guys I did it, but um, I'm not going to do it on the stream. I just don't want to risk accidentally. Showing you guys like my, my card information or something like that. You know what I mean? Just have to be just have to be safe, but I'll definitely um do the donation after the stream and post it on Discord. But anyways guys, that was a that was a hell of a race. That was fun. I had a lot of a lot of laughs, a lot of good times here. And uh, you guys definitely made the time go by faster just by talking. I didn't realize that how fast the time was going on this race. But my right leg is definitely killing me. <laughs> No, thank you, Phil. Thank you, Phil, for inviting me. You, Max Turbo, Jay, all you guys, thank you so much. Alrighty, boys and girls. Well, that was it right there. Let's see what happens if I do this. There we go. See my, my head indentation <laughs> from the from the uh um the headphones. Now what's interesting is that there's supposed to be a chat box. Oh there it is. There he is, good. <laughs> yeah, it's supposed to be a chat vlog. It's supposed to be happening right here, which is great. But, um, anyways, final words. Um, again, thank you so much to everyone who tuned in. Thank you to everyone who donated as well to the cause. We were able to raise, well, just from this, this link right here, we were able to raise, um, $240 out of the $100 goal. I'm going to add $50 included into that, so that's going to be 290 just off of this link. But I guess there's a second link going around. So that might push up the uh, final donation um, amount even higher. So it's awesome. Round of applause to all you guys, everyone who donated, everyone who, who tuned in. Thank you. Thank you guys so much. As well as everyone who left a like on this uh, live stream. Thank you guys so much. 68 likes. Absolutely smashed it. I know it's a Sunday. A lot of you guys couldn't do something else, but you guys decided to come hang out, come do a, uh, come join for a good cause, and all I can say is thank you. Uh, also, big thank you um, before I head out as well to K Dub, uh, Zuber, and Sir Max Turbo for the donations just to the channel. I say you guys uh, help the lights stay on, help the streams go, and help us do this crazy stuff like this on almost a daily basis. But it's gonna be a stream tomorrow for a brand new week of daily racing, and um. Yeah, that's it. Any last words? Yes, exactly, Rebecca. Good job, Ray. Yeah. <laughs> ah, close-ups. Yeah. I don't know where the other link is at. Um, if only you guys can put it on the chat, maybe. Or, I don't know. If you guys probably go on Discord, it'll probably be on there. Yeah, thank you, Phil. Alrighty, then. Check you guys out tomorrow for the Monday stream, and uh, again, I'll post uh, the I'll put I'll post the donation on the Discord. 
so, so you guys can see right there and um yeah until tomorrow guys good morning good afternoon good evening good night whenever you guys are watching whatever time you guys are watching hope you guys have a great one and i'll see you guys later peace